guys, my name is Dang Mai Mi and you can call me Nari. And today I'm going to talk about something, which is, um, Katie's find, Katie's, um, finding a lot of things in the forest. But why? And what happened? So, Katie was just finding a lot of things like flowers and, yeah, to add to her collection nature collection of course and katie saw this beautiful flower yellow flower and she added to her backpack but then she thought oh i also have a lot of things before i saw this guys i have an a fruit which is like an acorn with a like a little curly hat and um a pine corn so then she was going with her brother but luckily her brother was far away because she was frightened by something very small because she thought it was a grizzly bear because her brother usually joke grizzly bears are here in the forest so she thought it was a grizzly bear behind her but it's just a chipmunk she wanted to put it in her backpack too but it was too big and doesn't fit so while they are going up now they already are up so they her father wanted to ask what do you want to do her brother said take off your shoes and jump into the stream her mother said put everything down and sleep her, her brother, I mean her father doesn't like any of those things. Her, her father said we have to lighten up the wood so that it's easy to see in the dark. So then they do the same thing and then they sleep. Well, they sleep. Oh, I didn't say that. We'll wait a minute. Um. So also, the most important thing is that she's told her father about the thing that she saw, like the chipmunks, and she wanted to make friends with them. She wanted to get a food. So yeah, but her father said it's dangerous and also it's not good for us and the chipmunk. The chipmunks is gonna lose the skills of hunting food so it can't hunt food and it will just follow us all the way home and also it is a wild chipmunk and it can bite so yeah when they go to sleep in the morning katie is the first one to wake up she saw this deer even though she wanted to pet it on and follow it but the, she thought again she couldn't because she remembered what her dad said so she waited calmly, patiently, waiting for it to finish drinking from the stream. And then it's her turn. When the deer ran away, it's her turn to wash her face in the stream. When she saw this a very good uh, quartz, it's very beautiful. It's like stars. So yeah, she wants to keep it. Yeah, she keep it to her backpack. But then all of her family wake up, woke up and said, let's put everything in the trash, all the trash. And she said, where's the trash can? There are no trash can. Dad said, put it in your backpack. But then Katie said, but I have my nature collection in there and it's all full in my backpack. Dad said with a frown, I told you, what if someone take all your stuff? What if, someone take your lunch box so all the food you are keeping is from the squirrels or the chipmunks and other small insects or other animals food so you don't would like it if you were the chipmunks and also if you um If you kept the flower the where it was, then it will
will be growing right now. And even though it died there, it will still produce a seed. And then next year, a flower will grow. So you have to know what nature is like. Thank you for listening. So bye.